Hello and welcome to this introduction video. In this video, I want to show you how my indicator works and how you can use it. You see here on the left a watch list with the S&P stocks and on the right my chart with these market zones from my indicator. When you go here to um, indicators, you see the chart the volume chart profile, this is this here, the market profile, or in other words, the volume add-on from a Gina Trader. This is a must, otherwise you cannot trade with my indicator. Important is that the, the parameters that you put in here are the same like the parameter that you put in in my volume zone finder. Otherwise you will get wrong signals. You see here these zones, and this zone can be um, switched, or you can change the numbers, the percent. For example, here when I put 0 0.1, it means 10%. You can see here that the zones are getting bigger, and so you will you will get here more signals. I switch it back to 5% because I screened the market with this 5%. So, how you can work with my indicator? You see here, volume zone finder, this is the general indicator who contains all signal. When I click here, you see, okay, these are generated signals from the system and you see here is a signal in the extremely um, value zone, you have here a signal at the volume area high here in this level. You have here a signal at the volume point of control. So does it works very quick and very well. You have also this uh, gray zones here. These zones um, tell you that here the actually price is in the fair value zone and so you don't have two trades. So this is my personally experience. Perfect. When you go to the watch list here with a right click to indicators you will find here all the indicators so the general indicator who contains all these signals you can find these indicators when you write volume zone finder, this is this here. And for the special signals, you can write volume with underline and you can find here the other signals. Important, I want to repeat it again, the signals that you have here need to have the same parameters like the volume chart profile and the volume zone indicator here in the chart. And interesting for you to know that you can also use this screening or this indicator with different time frames that you can switch here. Perfect. I hope that I could give you an idea how you can work with this indicator and you can write me, you can contact me if you need more information about. Thank you for your attention.